down back at Tinagai today, down in Coinant. Something a little bit special today. Um, since getting back into fly fishing the last couple of months, <coughs> I've been looking for a, a blue flash damsel. Um, I had something in my head, just trying to find the pattern. Somebody that sold it. Looked everywhere, high and low, every website, eBay, you name it. Couldn't find it. Um, but I have had a good friend of mine, Mr. Bafton, Taft Bargoy Flies. Um, tied me some flies recently, and I thought I'd have a little look through his stock of flies. And funny enough, there was three flies of his that had the main ingredients <laughs> of what I wanted on my fly. Um, so a quick little message to Andrew. And within oh, less than 10 minutes, he'd already tied my fly up for me. So, today the target is to see how quick we can catch three fish on the new fly. The OS G over she goes damsel from Mr. Buff Dunn. So without more to do I think it's time to get into these fish. Right, let's get the first cast out. Right then. I'm not gonna let this sink. Oh, straight away, as soon as it hit the surface. <laughs> That's a good fish. That's a good fish. First cast on a new fly, and we're straight into one. Literally hit it on the on the drop. Good fish this is. Take me right out into the middle of the pool. Oh, and it's still going. The OSG from Mr. Buff Dunn, a Taft Bar Guide Flies. First cast on the drop. I went into something reasonably nice here. Oh, come on. Took me right out into the middle of, middle of the lake. And he's not stopping for anybody. Ooh. Come on. This is what we want first thing in the morning. This fish is not stopping for anybody. Ooh. Come on. Ooh. Good knuckle buster first thing in the morning. I actually stepped down a little bit on my fluorocarbon as well. Down using a seven pound airflow G3. Sight free leader, tip it, whatever you want to call it. Ooh, these fish are fighting hard today. What a fish to catch on the first cast. Oh, this fly is going to do some damage. This fly's gonna do some serious damage. Oh, first cast. He couldn't write there. This fish doesn't want to come in for anybody. Let's tighten the drag up a touch. Come on. A bend in our rod. It's a vision still maniac. Seven weight, ten foot. And he's scrapping really well. Come on. Come on. It's all tidy look, yo. 
Oh, no way. No way, no way, no way. That was an absolute stonking fish, that was. Never mind. Never mind. Let's get back out there again. Let's see if we can do it again. Nice long line. Let it sink. Well, I don't think I did let it sink the last time. Literally, as soon as it hit the water, I cracked the line. Figure of eight. It's possibly me bullying the fish again. <laughs> Getting excited to bring it in. Can't fault that. <laughs> if I was the way Carlsberg made flight testing, <laughs> that would be it. First cast on the drop. That was a beautiful fish as well. That was it was more than it was five pound, if not more. So try again. Plenty of fish in ya. Alright, just come for a quick move. Lots of fish plucking at the fly down here, but this is the way the wind's blowing. This is where all the natural food should be going. Lots of fish moving up this way. Looks like they're on buzzers, so. It's a first cast. Let's see what we can do. Lots of small fry in the water up here as well. Straighten all the fly up, just let it sink. Just keep an eye. Now I want the little loop, little bow line at the end of the line, the end of the rod. Just in case anything hit it on the drop. Movement on his fly in the water is unbelievable. Flashing that tail as well. He's at Andrew Bufton have absolutely knocked that one out of the ballpark, fair play to him. I absolutely smashed it out of there. It's exactly what I wanted. <laughs> Just let him sink a little bit again. Might be up for a chase, these fish. Try something a bit faster. Here's a good pulse in the tail on this fly, so. And we got a nice bit of sun today. Another fish moving by there. I think these fish are on, uh, on buzzers.
Lots of fish rising now, everywhere. Might even make the most and get the dry fly on now. Oh, here we go. I think go. There we go. So all we needed was a move, follow the food source. The fish should be there with them. One. He doesn't want to come in. Come on. Out of the weed. Out of the weed. Come on. You're good fighting fish, don't you? Head up. It's a really nice fish, this is. It's a good fish, this is. Really nice fish. It's a good six pound, this fish. Five, six pound, easy. Look what's in his mouth. Look what's in there. Absolutely annihilated it. The OSG damsel, courtesy Mr. Bufton, a taff bar guide flies. Alright, so just a quick tidy up of the fly. Look at that in the sun. Look at that. My little idea was nice blue bead that I seen the taff bag I'd use with their wicked zonkers and other flies it's a nice olive and blue frets through the body and a nice olive tail with some blue flash through it and this thing is just pulse 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 through the water absolutely deadly at the minute nothing following our time Crack the line again. Let's try along the surface this time. Oh, there we go. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Want a little bit faster, but eh? these fish are really fighting today. Spring is in full swing. Still loads of fish rising. Getting to some buzzer action, I think. Another lovely fish. And I've left the net all the way up here. Absolutely nailed this fly, you have. Absolutely smashed it. Go on. Oh. 
I don't know what's shining nicer in the sun, the fish or that damsel coming in on it. <laughs> Look at that. That's an ab another absolute stonking fish that is. That's not a four pound. It's a good four or five pound. Easy again. Dispatch him. That's another fish. That's absolutely nailed. The new OSG damsel. Absolutely smashed it. And that fly's had two fish on already. And it can catch another 200 fish. Still perfectly intact. What a fly this is turning out to be. Alright, so here we go. The OSG tied by Mr. Buff Dunn himself. A taff bar guide flies. That's had no end of fish hit it at the minute. Um, and accounted for two fish. First cast on the drop first ever cast with the fly let me add <laughs> on the drop hit a fish there was a good five six pound and just taking another two fish here over four pound each i haven't got scales with me but we're gonna have one more cast with this now and uh, get into some dry fly action i think take some fish off the top So, same as last time, not going to mess about with it, let it sink, there's a lot of fish high up in the water, see if they want to chase, like the last one. A little pause in here, just in case there's any fish following, let's watch our line, see if it straightens up. Carry on. Here's the end of the line now. Oh, there's a fish. Here we go, here we go, here we go. What did I say? <laughs> Always watch that fly and leave it on a hang. Watch that fly, come, the fish come all the way in then and take that. And he absolutely nailed it. <laughs> Mr. Buff done. Of one fine fly in the army here you now this oh these fish are absolutely smashing it I did have a little doubt thinking he might have just been on buzzers taking flies off the surface but it's always worth speeding the cast up just let the line hit the water and just strip it straight in no time to sink I know I've got an intermediate uh, intermediate line on the tip tip section a medium intermediate but <clears throat> there's no need of it oh, he is absolutely engulfed this fly I've done it again, I've got my net. Come on, out the weeds. He is absolutely engulfed this flight. He didn't half want this one. Oh. He didn't half want his fly. Come on, up we come. Sorry guys, it's a bit awkward with this, uh, this first mount. Beauty comes. Oh, there's another stonking fish. Absolute stonking fish again. What a day we're having on this fly. I think that might even be borderline the biggest fish of the day so far. Possibly. He's a little bit longer and just as fat as the other fish. 
this out, look, it's gonna let it off in. And here's our fly again. Absolutely smashed again. You all knew. Let's get the line off. Let's tidy him up a little bit. See, that's the third fish landed on this fly. And it's still perfect. What a fly this is at the minute. So, just goes to show, always leave the fly on the hang. With a fast retrieve, there's a good possibility a fish will follow it all the way into the bank, like that one did. Let's tidy the fly up a little bit. What an absolute booty that is. So what we're going to do now, um, i got a line on the floor and I cast it out and wind it in. Um, so what I'll do, I'll wind it in and then I will switch over to a dry fly. So let's see if we can take a fish, wind the line in. Get a nice long line out. Hands are stinking dirty. And just wind him in. Oh, there we go. <laughs> what? <laughs> what did I say? Winding the fly, oh, and he come off. So if I leave the fly there, I'll carry on winding it in. I'll leave it for hang. Alright, there's nothing there following. Right. <laughs> so, over and out from the OSG damsel at the minute. Get some dry flies on, that bit of fun. Let's try something a little different. Let's get a good line out. Let it hit the surface. And roly poly it in. See if we can get any fish to chase. There's a bow wave, there's a bow wave, there's a bow wave, there we go, there we go. <laughs> the OSG damsel, what a fly. Absolutely slaying a fish here fish today. <laughs> it's finding it quite hard to keep the, the fly fishing along the bottom with it pulling through weed. Um, So it was easier just to maybe get them to chase a little bit harder. Oh, he's fighting well, this one. All the fish have fought well here today. I honestly think if I could stay here all day and go catch and release, I'd probably put 100 fish on the bank. Well, under fish to the fly. That's how savage it is. Ooh. Come on, up we come. Up we come. Oh, you wanted this one. He's not coming off. Here she comes. Oh, not yet.
There she is. Another beauty fat fish. That's another big fat fish as well, that is. Another fish smashing the OSG. Absolutely nailing it. Rubbish cast. Oh, there's a fish chasing. There's a fish chasing. <laughs> Don't want to get, want to get. Ew. Oh. That's the fly gone. <laughs> oh no. That's the fly gone. I'm glad I got that one on camera. Because that one just went absolutely berserk for it. <laughs> I couldn't pull the line in any quicker. And the fish came in and absolutely annihilated it. So. Another one on. Same place. As soon as it's a water, roly poly. Wait for the bow wave. Into the water, not letting it sink. There's a lot of fish up high in the water today. There's a bow wave. There he is. Come on, there he is again. Oh, look, there he is. Oh, this one's going. I think this one back in the reel. This is the last fish of the day, so. Another nice fish. Staying deep. Come on. Oh, I'm surprised, surprised the net's over here again. And tied himself out. Come on.
having some absolute excellent sport here today. These fish are really fighting hard now. So I'll credit the dike. Credit the dike, the owner. Very well stocked, very well looked after this lake. And these fish, they don't half hang on. Fly has actually slipped on him. Here's a fish, here's a fish. Yeah, you're on with that. Yeah, you're Ooh, with see him turn off? Did he turn off? Yeah, you can see yeah. him coming in. There you are, you're on here. Yeah. He's there? No, 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 no. No. <laughs> see him again. He's following me. Yeah, he's following that all the way and then really close. <laughs> are you showing him the trick with the, in the armpit? No. Uh, I'm not sure if it'll be easier for you. Do you want to try it under? Uh... Yeah, okay. Wait, right, there, there we go. Hello. You want it at that time? Yeah. Might have to keep this fly a secret. I think so, yeah. I was going to put it... <laughs> Advertise it everywhere for Andrew, but I think we have to keep this one quiet. Yeah. <laughs> it's a nice fish, it is. Yeah, it is. It's a nice fish. I like being on a reel, I do. Yeah. Yeah, it's a lovely fish. Stand back a little bit. Giving up a really good fight. It's a lovely fish, that is. It's a good fish. Yes. That's a big fish, that is. That's, a, that's about six pounds, that is. That's, about, that's a good six pounds, easy, that is. Easy. Look what's in his mouth. Deadly. Blue flash. OSG damsel. Absolute beautiful fish, that is. Do you want to lift him up now, photo? Yes, okay. Yes, it's Look at that one. It's a cracker, that is. That's six pounds easy. I got whiskey as well, see now. It's the first day out with the, the new damsel, the OSG, tied by Mr. Buffton, the tap bar guide flies. What an absolute success that was. Just to summarise up, first cast, first ever cast with our fly. Fish hit it on a drop. Um, it was a fish of four plus, four pound plus, but come off. Um, so I moved on the lake then, to where the wind was blowing and pushing all the fish. It was a lot of fish rising. Um, we hit the fish in quick succession few fish came off where they were just smashing the fly uh, really quick I think they were just sort of catching the tail maybe not quite all of the hook but towards the end um, we had a little bit of a fun then with a very similar to a yellow yellow owl pattern um, on the top it has a little bit of a sight indicator on the top of it with a buzzer fished underneath um, took lots and lots of fish with that. Striking out a range just seemed to bounce the fish off. But um, yeah, very, very good productive day. And on that note, thanks for watching again, guys, and we'll catch you soon.